All right, what is going on, everybody? I'm back with another video. It is about almost seven o'clock. I just finished up fishing here at this creek that I've fished many times, many, many, many times. And it's two days past the opening day, and I caught like 20 fish, including a palomino. So you're gonna see that. If you fish this creek opening day, you missed a couple. There's a fish. Rainbow trout. Oh, that was almost bad. I almost got hooked. Swallow somebody's hook. I'm not going to try to dig that out. That's a terrible idea. Nice little rainbow. Got away from somebody. Put him back. So this, there were people here opening day using mealworms. A lot of times they don't get the fish that are up there though. This hole usually has a decent amount of fish. They're usually skittish too. Oh, I had one on for a second. I think about this bag is it hurts my back. I think it's because I have too much stuff in it. There's a fish. This rainbow. It's not very deep here, but the current is so fast. That's why usually when the creek's low, people wait, end up waiting this section. But the water is moving pretty fast and it's not deep, but it's like if you get swept, you're fucked. Trout number two. I plan on getting the water up there too and casting downstream. That's you're, that's fun catching fish like that. And I'm f really hot under here. Just walking to here from where I started, I was I'm roasting already. My legs are for the most part. I'm wearing jeans after these. There's another one. Ah, uh, darn tootin'. There's one. Oh my god. That was nuts. This was nuts. Kind of snagging a little bit. There we go, trout number three. There we go. Please stay on. That's how easy it is. That was a fish too, I'd folded. I folded so bad on that one. He hit it as I was like doing that motion. There's a fish, I told you they were down there. This guy's a baby. I caught a baby here last year, I think, too. This is an excellent spot to lose fish at. There we go. All these have to go. This has to go. Anything that will be in my way has to go. Right here. Right at my feet. I'm backwards. I need to twist around. This guy wasn't coming off. 
But he would have found a way if I gave him an extra five seconds. God, you got yourself all dirty, dude. There's one. That was weird. It's like they disappear right when they're in line of sight. They just disappear right the last, right before. Number. I'm counting it. I'm counting it. Came out of the water. I'm counting it. It experienced airtime. It's number eight? Nine? I don't know. I don't think it's shallow enough for me to want to walk in here. There's no fish in front of that, really. Right there, it's deep. Right, in, there's a little deep spot right in there. It's usually where the car hang out at. There's one. It came off. These need to move. Should I count that one? Because I could have pulled it out of the water, but I just didn't. There's a fish. Oh, that was a fish. I think that have been a palomino. I'm not even joking. That might have been a palomino. Actually, I might, might have been a bass, you know? Smallymouth bass year. First smallmouth of the year. Hey, front flip. There's a dead carp right here. I know exactly where he came from. His trout will hit right by your feet in this hole. That was such a perfect cast. I couldn't do that again. What did I just say? Couldn't do that again. I... Anti reverse fucked up. <laughs> I hit the anti reverse on my rod. This guy is pulling. <laughs> anti reverse. I'm like, what the fuck is going on with my reel? I didn't even know my reel had an anti reverse. I never use it. What do you even use the anti reverse for? Somebody in the comments, please tell me what an anti-reverse is for. Just have it no no reverse at all. Don't even have that an option. All right, shot number 10, I think. Right at my, almost at my feet, but you know what I'm saying? Like they hit right, right at your feet. Someone's in the comments gonna say, wet your hands. Bro, my hands are soaked. What are you talking about? My hands are soaked. There you go. It's hard to fish this hole in the creek's hot too. Cause right here, you'd be getting swept away. That was almost really cool, but I fucked it up. There we go. These are all rainbows today. Heck yeah. There's a little rock right there you can stand on. I've caught fish on this side before. 
it's not very easy to land them. It's pretty difficult. But it's possible. Getting stabbed. A duck landed right next to him. It's a fish. What did I say? This fish over here, you can't get to. That person in that Jeep is watching me if they have a passenger. I, I was a fish. Right at, the, right at my feet. That's a nice looking rainbow. Here we go. He was hooked in the mouth, now he's kind of sad. Now he's sad. Yo, did you watch the eclipse today, fish? Must have because you that those are that ran into you and missed your mouth, so you must have looked at the eclipse today. What I mean you can't get to the side is the fish it's deep on this side, it's deeper, and these fish just sit down in the current. And you cannot get to them unless you're over here. Is that a brown trout? It's a smallmouth bass. Take a picture. Oh, he's going down to fucking Sunoco. I'm gonna go past him though. I, I know a spot. Second smallie of the year. This one is pretty orangish. Orangish tint to him. Rainbow. What else is in here? Freaking. They sit over there in that little current. It used to be shallow over there, but now it's decently deep. Right at my feet. Number 16 or 17. Getting too easy. I thought like all these fish have gone. I don't know what. I just lost a fish fin. Palomino, let's go! Let's go! This guy's jumpy. Hell yeah, let's go! Look at that. Are all Palominos male? No, that's not, I can't be, right? Second Palomino of the year. This one is a lot smaller, maybe like a 15 incher, but pretty fish. This one has a lot better looking face than the last one I got too. That was sick. Someone's bucket. He's sitting right here. He's just hanging out with me. This is Richard, the Palomino trout. It was like sand in my reel again. And mine is lying around it. 
There's gotta be a fish from fish from that one. I don't know the Richard, dude, are you telling your friend? He's telling his friends. Come on, Richard. I thought we were friends. I let you go. I let you live. There we go. I knew there was one in here. Easy peasy. All right, that is gonna be it for this video. 20, 20 or so fish, I don't know, I lost count, including a Palomino, which was unexpected. Did all right for it being kind of swept out. This whole section, it's cleaned up, cleaned up shop. They stock it this week and some other day in May or whatever, so I'll probably fish a couple times for trout, but my next video, I think, oh, I'm gonna to try to go musky fishing this weekend. If I get one, you'll see that video, if not, probably be trout fishing again anyway if you like this video please like subscribe do all that really appreciate it and see you later